Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel for yet another beautiful vlog and in today's episode we are going to go around with you. I'm going to take you around to see this one project that I handled when I got straight from campus and yeah, it was an electrical workshop that we did for Marigo Technical and today we are doing and handing over to the school so that they can start using this house. So we are going to go around and inspect so that we rectify in any area that there was any problem or something of that kind. So I thought it wise to go with you around so that you can get maybe an hint of what I do contractor and so we're going to go with you guys hope you enjoy this vlog and if you are new here make sure make sure you subscribe and if you are a returning subscriber I love I love you so much The office to go and have a talk with the, with the clients, they let us know where they were some care problems. We like where we didn't do some good work so that you can redo and get clear with them. So that's where we go. Guys. guys we are right at this is this is the the other one was the front view so this is the back view of this building and just like i told you i want to get in with you guys so that you see you see what we did like the quality maybe the painting works the how beautifully we designed this house and how everything just turned out to be so nice so let's go into it like we're going to this other side this is the ram this is the ram so we are going to use the ram so that you guys can see how we 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 did this ramp initially this house was designed with a spiral ramp but we couldn't do that one because of the students like they couldn't move swiftly with their with their with the electrical equipment like the the conduit pipes there's no way they are going to move in a in a in a, in a spiral in a spiral ramp so we decided to do this straight ramp to reason their their movement and maybe for safety and all that so let's get into it we are going straight to the second floor. It has three. It has three floors. We have the ground floor, the first floor, and the second floor. So we are going to start from the farthest, farthest floor as we come down. We are almost at the second floor. I think you can see that. Yeah, this is where the, the columns are ending. These, these are the columns that were supporting this roof, the roof that is covering the, the ramp. Yeah, it wasn't initially in the plan, but we decided to to bring in these these columns so that this thing will stand like equal stable. Yeah, stand strong so that at a feel like how many students it will still be very strong that it doesn't cause any any scene of accident. So we are right at the second floor and this is the balcony and you can see it's so big, so special and it's very beautiful. I think students love such like things like just somewhere they could be chilling, seated, maybe doing their notes, reading and stuff. So we are going to go straight into the lecture halls that we did. On this floor we have three lecture halls and I'm going to show you guys Yeah, Let's go with you. We are right into the first classroom. This is the first lecture hall for the second floor. And you can see it's not that big, but it's it's big enough for the students to be accommodated here. Let's get to the second classroom. Here is the second classroom. It's also not so big, but 
it's big enough for the students to be accommodated behind. As you can see, it's so spacious. A lot of lighting, the windows are so big, it's good. The, 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 the ventilation is so good. Let's get to the third classroom. So these are this is the third classroom on this floor. This is so big. So this design has been done on this second floor. Again, it's the same design on the first floor and it's the same design on the ground floor. The design only changes on the other way. And I'm going to show you guys. Then we can get into on this on this floor. This is the this this side is the students' washroom. So these are this is the gents and this is the the, the ladies' washroom. And the farthest end, show them. The farthest end has the staffs washroom. So let's get let's get to first floor. So, We are right inside the gents' washroom, and this, these are the, 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 the worktop, these are the basements, and we can take another look at the tiles, though it's so dirty. These are a project that we handed over around last year, last year October. So it's been six months since we handed over, and if anybody understands what construction is, we do, we do the last inspection after six months where we check whatever wrong that we did that needs to be rectified so that we get the, the retention amount. So yeah, that is what you are doing today and you know? basically that's why this place is so that it's not, it has not been in use. So these are the mirrors, these are the basins and uh, these are the urinals like you can see. These are the, the, the washroom tilings that we did and let's get inside them. Yeah, you can see the washrooms. Yeah, that is the the the, the main washroom. There are three there are three washrooms, and what was done on this washroom has been done on the the upper washroom, that is the second floor, gents washroom, and the ground floor, gents washroom. And let's I'm going to go with you guys again into the ladies washroom, ladies wing, and right here is the ladies washroom. You can see how special the workshop is, the mirror, the tiling, the painting works, and you can as well check inside. And you can see how we, we did the, the toilets. And same to the ladies' washroom, what was done on this floor, we are on the first floor, was done on the second floor and on the ground floor. So basically, what you see here is what is happening on both the floors. I'm going to show you guys what we did for the store. We also provided a store for the cleaners. And here is the store, it's lockable, so they can keep all their cleaning items here and whatever they need to store. And this is the store, just a space, it's so big and it's, it's a spacious one. So yeah, that is all for the washrooms and I'm going to show you the, the staff's washroom too. Yeah, this is the staircase, just as you can see, it's also very special. The walls are so clean, so like so clean. We use the, the soft toys. And we are right at the ground floor. And this is the gents washroom. The same thing I've shown you up. And this other side is the ladies washroom. The same thing that I did on the first floor. And let's get going to the actual to this ground floor classrooms. So basically the classrooms are the same, there's nothing different. This is the ground floor left and uh, And then in this ground floor we also have offices, we don't have an office that I'm showing you. So what basically has been done here is what is happening for the first floor and the second floor. The offices are this size and I think this, the plan to decide on how to design and maybe how to set out the arrangement and stuff. But this is really the future. This is the, the entrance. This other side the entrance is here and the main entrance is now here. This is the last classroom. The ground floor. So basically the ground floor has two classrooms and four offices. These are the two offices. 
here is the red chapel. The people is trying to install the equipment and the fathers and the red place to install the equipment so that students get to use them once they go back to school. I think that is around May. Yeah. So let's get to the staff solution. Yeah, maybe chilling, relaxing, waiting for classes and all that. So yeah, let let me take you around and see how the old computer will be. This is it. This is the like this one is, I can confess this is the first project I handled when I got from campus. I didn't do anything related to building and construction, but this is what God blessed me with and I had to take it and I really love it. I enjoy each and every bit of construction. Personally I Banking, but I got myself into the field into the field of building and construction. This is one thing that I really love. So yeah, this is the ramp. You can see how beautiful it is. Yeah, going down. They also have like a chilling space. Maybe you want to, to do your personal studies, you'll be chilling down there. And then just as you can see, there's a lot of repair work going on in the school. These are the sides. We are trying to connect this building to the other buildings for uniformity. So you will notice, you'll notice there is a lot going on. Let me show you. about this project and thank you very so much for watching my video if you are a returning subscriber thank you so much thank you so much and feel loved and if you know you are new here just hit the subscription button down below and you also need the, you also hit the notification button so that you get notified that this kid baby girl uploads a new video and thank you so much bye bye see you next time in my next video